Coach, first off, grade your team's performance. How do you, can you really gauge how well they did knowing it was a blowout game? Yes, absolutely, because uh, the game started 0-0, zero, zero, right? And then we got to the blowout. And guys played hard from the start. I thought it was a good uh, focus on, on, on the details and our preparation. Guys did a good job executing, absolutely. A lot of three-point shots early from the big men. Was that a, a part of the game plan, or did that just present itself? Well, we want to take the shots that are available. You know, if, 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 our, if our offense produced a shot, we're okay with it. Nothing forced. As long as it's in the floor of our offense and it makes sense, we're okay with it. What's the challenge for you as a coach when it becomes a large lead, trying to gauge, not knowing the level of competition, trying to gauge where your guys are at? Well, the thing is, you know, we focus on us, and we got We want to make sure that uh, regardless of the score, we are still working on good habits. You know, we're executing our system, and and because ultimately, we're, this is a great platform for our guys to keep learning and growing. So regardless of what the score is, we'll still want to make sure that we have the right approach, the right focus, and we work on the right stuff. Through two games, Kennedy Meeks has filled it up pretty quickly for you guys. Uh, Kennedy Meeks filled it up pretty quickly for you guys in the first two games. What have you seen from him through practices in the, the first couple outings here? He works hard. He works hard. He pays attention to detail. He's smart. He's smart, and, and he has a good feel for the game. Yeah. Do you think people underestimate him maybe a little bit because he came into college a little bigger um, and he has that baby face? Well, first of all, I will tell him that you, you said he had a baby face. Uh, but no, you know, I don't, I don't really know his history all that well. I'm not very familiar with it. Uh, I don't know that people underestimate him. But all I know is when we get into uh, those four lines, he gives you what he has, intellect, energy, and effort, and good feel for the game. Speaking with intellect, having Fred out there as kind of an extension of you guys, he already kind of plays like a veteran a little bit. How, use, how helpful is that for you guys here trying to acclimate all these pieces? Well, Fred is a carrier of our culture. You know, he does it at practice. Practice. He does it off the court and then on the court also. He make he Fred makes all of us look good. You know he's very smart, works extremely hard. Wants this opportunity, wants it really bad. He, he doesn't talk about it. He shows it. He's you know he's everything a coach would ever want in a player. What's the message of the group now that you're two and zero moving forward? Come again. What's the message of the group now that you're two and zero moving forward? We gotta keep plowing away. Stay humble. Put your head down. Keep working. We're here to do a job. Is this your first game as head coach? No, I've coached, I've coached games before, yeah, as a head coach, yeah. Okay. Was it fun out there anyway, though? Yeah, it's always fun. Any opportunity to coach, touch guys, and impact, impact winning, it's always fun.